I'm gonna ask this question, and you don't have to answer it yes or no. You can give it as me as as much as of an elaborate answer as you want. And I want Caillou. I want you to go first, cause I know what this I, motherfucker I, is gonna say. Bro, I can smell the bullshit from a mile oh, away. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Breathe that fucking fucking malarkey in right now. Okay. This nigga really did. Is GT canon or not? Go ahead, answer the question. <laughs> that's a good, that's a good answer right there. <laughs> he shut his camera. Turn the light over. <laughs> that's me some dumb shit. What the fuck? Is GT canon or not? Bro. Not, this is not a trick question. This is as as. It's not canon, bro. I want your honest no answer. Matter, I don't care what any, you say. Any information you straight up pulled out of GT is irrelevant. That's not the point. Irrelevant. I want I want kind of answer first. You probably gotta say the same thing. <laughs> I want him to answer. Damn it. I'm not. My answer is if you care. You have unresolved issues. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's my final answer. Now, if you defend that as canon, you, that, you really got to fucking get tested. Oh, let's get tested then, because I got something to say. Oh, let's go. <laughs> he said, let's get tested, boys. All right, Pop let's quiz. get tested. Pop quiz, here we go. And I'm taking it back. Full Power Podcast is the GT edition, ladies and gentlemen. All right, I'm sorry. I had to get that out of there. Anyway, um... This is this is what I wanted to say about that, okay? Because, you know, we bring GT up often enough. Maybe not an maybe not as often, but often enough, right? We always talk about the good out of GT, and oh, we, of course we shit on the bad. Of course, why would why why the fuck would we want to talk about all the bad stuff? GT is shunned on for many reasons. Many of those reasons are the bad ones, right? But but then people love. The, the the part the obvious stuff Gogeta Super Saiyan Four Mega Shenron, you know what I'm saying the Black Star Dragon Balls, right? Just a, just to name a few. Okay, that's probably all of all of the reasons. But you know whatever. <laughs> and so then I thought to myself, okay, let me put on Toei's hat. Okay, I'm gonna think like a Toei employee or someone from Bird Studio, right? I just and it, and it, it kind of hurt when I thought this way because I was like, wow. This fucking hat sucks, number one, okay? I want to take it off. It's too tight. My head hurts, okay? <laughs> and I realized that GT is going to be canon until further notice. That is literally my my conclusion to this whole, this whole uh, discussion here. Because we can't... Like and pe and I know I know that people are probably gonna get riled up and just come at me hard for this right now. I don't care. I am immune to it at this rate. Like you know, you guys know how to talk to whoever if you want to actually have a conversation about it, and I will acknowledge those people. Right? All the head ass gets deleted. Well, it doesn't really get deleted, but you know, I just don't acknowledge <laughs> your shit. All right. But either way, y'all know how to have a have a convo with your boy, right? But honestly, when you really think about it, I mean, look at how they handle what's current right now. They give us vague shit after vague shit. They, they do things. They don't really say fully what the fuck's actually happening, what they mean, the intention behind it. So then it's just like, well, if they're pulling our chains, right? They're literally pulling our dragon balls, okay? They have us, okay? And we're just here for the ride. We're just waiting. We're just like, this is like a, a very toxic relationship between the fans and those that are making it, right? When it comes to GT, dude, until they do something where they come or they, whether they come out and say it straight up or if they write it in somehow or they start like, yo, worst case scenario, they just straight up adapt what happens from GT. Like, I don't think anyone's ever even thought of that because no one wants that to happen. That's that's as clear as day. Sometimes the 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 the, the loudest reaction you can get is silence, right? Not a peep, 
from the fandom. Not a single person has ever said, I guarantee you this, not a single person has ever said, I want them to adapt GT 100% the same. No one's going to say that. Because that's one of the few things that all of us could agree on. Whether you think Gohan is the strongest or whether you think, like, Bulma's wishes was accurate, okay? It doesn't matter. But when it comes down to this right here, GT is as canon as whatever as the next fucking thing that they they recently come out with i can't agree but how i can't how do you, you, how do you... i can't agree that it's canon just just because it's out that's just like saying the movies some of the movies are canon but that but see that's and my that's, that's my bullshit. point i know so this is not... and this, here here's here here's where i'm sitting at right i'm on i'm not even on the fence i'm on the fucking the bleachers up there that's kind of you i have view of both sides and i'm just like oh you guys are fucking dumbasses i'm trying to get over there because i know what's up but it's 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 just seeing how like like we 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 literally say what we say about toriyama and them quite often because of the what the the reasonings the examples and the shit the the impressions that they leave us with so it's just like, okay, well, if we're supposed to just make reads off of how they are, just with things as it is, apply that shit now to GT. And think about it. The last thing that I remember them saying, remember remember that shit, the, a part of the vague stuff, when they were talking about how like, oh yeah, like they brought Broly out of, you know, out of the movies and it's more fun this way when we kind of just leave it open and like, it's almost like insinuating that it's like even the movies now could fit right in like they don't want to say that they're not canon but they also don't want to confirm that they are or not so it's like gt i can't remember the last time they ever brought it up for one i can't remember the last time they ever ever even ever said that straight up oh yeah the events out of gt don't matter anymore because on their standpoint at a marketing standpoint fucking i put air quotes right because as like think of it as from a business perspective people are still buying into gt whether they want to believe it or not everybody's a, a classic gt fan everybody everyone's still drawing these characters everyone's still buying those fucking figures everyone's still paying money towards these games that include said characters that are constantly used and constantly getting all these different versions like why are there 10 versions of super saiyan 4 this that and the other why is there this many super babies you know what i'm saying omega shenron like dude it's a money game okay if they was to say that then people would be like oh well i get gt shit now right whatever like no they're not gonna say that because they still want people to just buy into everything oh they can't they still can't just throw in these movies and say they're canon because it doesn't line up with what they're showing us in real time listen, listen like it don't, it's that it don't simple. matter it's this is not rocket science of course it's canon you know why because they're just different continuities <laughs> unless you're telling unless you're gonna tell me they like unless you're gonna tell me <laughs> Yo, they're fucking gone. different fucking universes and shit like that, bro <laughs> different timelines i ain't buying it bro so no 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 help, on some on some real shit jokes aside help me understand why you think it's canon though because like in the actual sense of the word it's technically not like it's it's such a it's such a hard thing it's a hard side for me to pick which is why I said I don't give a fuck and no one else should give a fuck either you should just watch it if you don't like it great if you like it great it don't matter <laughs> right because in my eyes it was canon as a kid because I didn't I didn't know the fucking as difference. I saw it was on Toonami all the <laughs> same, so it didn't matter. As a, yes, I understand that. As a, as a kid, I get yeah, that. But yeah. what I'm saying is now, even as adult, even as an adult, I find out that Toriyama still had his hands on that work. So it's not like it was done without his knowledge. It's not like it was done without his signature. He had his hands on it. He came up with shit for it. He still did something for it. So even if he wasn't there writing the story, or even if he wasn't there doing enough to make it qualify as canon, he was still a part of it. So it's not just out there. So that's why I feel like it's walking in this thin, like, gray area that it shouldn't be but it is what it is and we have all these movies too so that's why i'm just kind of like what is what what was it that made you 
go to the side of being like, yeah, it's canon and it's such. Because the only thing I can think of is literally just that these guys, like Super Saiyan 4 and things like that, these characters are not going anywhere. Because it's like you said, they make money. And Broly himself opened the fucking door mm -hmm. for all these other non-canon characters to just yeet their way into the story. <laughs> but GT as a whole was not making money. <laughs> If we're, if we're gonna make this a money conversation, <laughs> GT was not making money. So why put a, a whole series of a product into the story that's making you money? That shit's just gonna reverse itself. I have the answers for both of you. And nah, bro. Like this would be <laughs> the worst. The this would be the, this would be the <laughs> worst said, Fuck direction of Dragon Ball as a whole. Like if they like seven years later, whatever. What like if they were to even get to that GT point, if they turn my nigga Goku small, first of all, there's going to be some real problems. That's, that's number one. So if they even decide to take anything out of GT, it better not be that. It better be Omega Shenron and Super Saiyan Forge, if anything. Yes. And like, arguably the, 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 the golden nigga and the silver nigga. Y'all didn't fuck a baby like that? And baby a little yeah, bit. Yeah, no, I, I, I was fucking baby. I fucked ba the baby. Baby was fire. Wait, are you talking about the other I fuck with Baby, Shenons? I fuck with Super yeah, 17, yeah, and I, I fuck with talking, the Shadow Dragons. Uh, yeah, I'm talking about the other Shen yeah, yeah, like, yeah, Shadow Dragons. Like, what, Nova, Nova Shenron? Yeah, Nova Shenron. And, and, oh, yeah. And the yeah. Bro, that, that Nova shit stay goaded. Yeah, no, like, those are acceptable people to <laughs> to, <laughs> to to put into the real story at, at <laughs> some point. But at the same time, we're going to have to understand the power scale and the way they make these characters and implement them into the new story, if they are, are going to be... Here's, they're gonna bro. be scaled so nah. high up it's not gonna be gt like the way it was because it wouldn't make sense because broly got a big power up like a big power boost no matter how we see it he still got one first of all <laughs> hey whoa whoa first of all you're trying to make sense of something let me remind you this is dragon ball <laughs> bring it back Kai. I'm the, I'm okay the, first of all <laughs> this is we, we're long back. past that point it's game over for that shit oh, i quit oh, all yeah. right i don't know what out. to fucking tell you hit the reset <laughs> button son oh yeah switch the fucking cartridge play, i don't know what's going on but here's, here's here's my other problem is like niggas want to hate on gt literally for no reason because like i get that like I get that there was a lot wrong with it and that whole Goku shrinkage shit was definitely a problem because at least it wasn't done it was right. It could have it could have been done better. But here's the thing. Out of everything in GT, say you only like 25% of it, right? Say you only like 25%. All the rest is head ass to you. How much head ass do we have as super right now? Yo. Hey. 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 I don't make the rules. I'm I, not I, trying to watch more head ass. That's okay. the whole. That's Me the, neither. That's my whole. But point. it's coming. It's coming. But who would even think in their right mind, like a 25 to? The, like, oh, well, well, hold on, hold on. That right. ratio is crazy. So, so here's all right. So let me all right. So let me let me let me let me let me bring it back now. Okay. <clears throat> so let me let me acknowledge a few things. So Toriyama, right? His involvement was so little that it it barely counts. He he gave like character designs the rest was Toei, right. right Toei wanted to continue the story toriyama was like nah dude. he's been over it right and you can tell it shows it shows it shows it's super it shows right people don't want to acknowledge that but that's episodes that we've already done so go watch them right um the other thing it's not a question of why would they do that why i'm not saying they are going to do that <clears throat> what i am just bringing to y'all attention is just off of how they are and when i say they i mean the powers that be that make this shit, right the way they are is not very uh safe <laughs> is the best way to put it like they don't give us any kind of real indication that the direction that they are gonna go in because we we don't know. I don't even want to say this shit. Not gonna lie, but like when you really think about it, they could kind of steer into that direction, but do it a lot better. And I'm only saying this just because I'm thinking yeah. about it now. But as far as like the the what should we call it? The Blue Dragon Ball Johns, the NGT, like 
what are they called? You talking about the Black Star Dragon? Yeah, Balls? the Black. Star, they can kind of implement that in there because yes of like Bulma wishing on. We her talked bullshit. about this. We kind of yeah. talked about this. Yeah. So Bulma's booty will get us Omega so, Shenron. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like I can Clap. see, I can kind of see it, <laughs> but they they have to take out and erase a lot of GT like for it to be enjoyable to watch, and that and like I don't know, I feel they would have to update that entire see, entirety see, of the situation because like once it, once Oob and once the Dragon Ball start getting fucked up because of all the wishes that are happening, like they're reoccurring at a fast rate, then at that point we'll we'll know at that point if uh. Like what they're gonna take from GT. Okay, so if they're gonna use it at all. So you're so the way Brother Uch is talking about this right now, right? And he's talking about this as a very worried, damaged fan. Okay. And that makes perfect sense because you're trying to make sense of it, right? And from what we have, that right? Is exactly. Canon, Ex well, that is but 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 again, right? They've never once gone out and said, listen, Geekdom can be on here. And he'll say the same thing. He'll be like, no, oh, no, it's not canon, right? And guess what? I agree. Because common sense tells me otherwise. Listen, if, okay. I, was, if I was... I'm going to put it like this, bro. <laughs> if I was the creator of GT and I said it was canon <laughs> at first, I would take my word back and say it was not canon. Well, see, but that's the, but that's the thing, though. <laughs> like, that, what? That's the that's thing. That's how bad it was. But that's, that doesn't, that's irrelevant. How bad it was is irrelevant to them. Because at the end of the day... Let's say if not, but like as a creator taking that back, that's like, that's, a, that's, that's disappointment. Yeah. Well, okay. In your own shit. But that's, but again, irrelevant because what matters is, okay, well, yeah, people shit on it and yeah, people meme on it and yeah, people didn't like it. And it definitely wasn't, it didn't live up to the standard and hype that Dragon Ball Z had, especially coming off of defeating fucking Majin Buu. Bro, right. They, this, yeah. But, but now, but now take all that into consideration, right? Even if it was, even if it didn't live up to that, guess what? It did fine enough for where even in today's day and age, they can still make money off of it. How many fucking boxes did GT have? They had two. Exactly. Yeah, but they, but the thing is, they didn't need more than that. Cause it was shit. Yeah, but again, <laughs> <laughs> but see the point, the problem. But that's the thing, right? I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get you to remove your defenses okay because because i'm not because look i'm not i'm not even trying to I'm argue at the product i know i'm not trying to argue <laughs> against none of y'all because i am all right I'll put it let me put this to rest i'm on you guys side they stopped okay. jt because of money problems they, they, well yes they had yes because they weren't producing nobody was watching it no one cared for exactly. it exactly but that but my point is is that when it comes down to it's... in the conversation of if GT is canon or not by the standards of how Toei is treating current Dragon Ball right now, you can't say that it's fully not. You can't listen to him. Because I, it's been able to be monetized for decades at a time. And it's never disappeared out of the video games. Or out of, it's exactly as you said. It's always been a staple part of the Dragon Ball franchise, exactly. even though it hasn't been canon. It's been canon in terms of money. You, well, yeah. So that's like saying the wrath of fucking dragons is a fucking is canon. No, no, no. See here. Arutaga. So the thing. So, but but again, you bring up the movies, and let me let me let me say this again. They, they, Toei, Toei, they, Broly. Toriyama, <laughs> they, they said, they said that it's more fun to leave things open, and the context in which they mention this is is as if they are trying to say that the movies are their own thing too this goes back to the whole separate continuities and all this yeah, shit which is garbage uh, it's garbage yeah you ain't gotta tell me because i know <laughs> but there are just there it's just it's just way too hard to even say some shit like that because like <clears throat> there with, with with some of with, with the way some of the movies are and the, like the stage they were at like at this point saying that any of those movies were canon like it's just so ass unless they take the character redo him up a little bit like they did broly and insert him into the fucking like the current anime real time which we've talked about like, plenty of times after they get their movie Freeza's like, army updated movie like well and implement them into the story like broly was that's all that's all i'm saying because like taking <laughs> taking someone like fuck what like did android like 13 
Yeah, the Android 13 movie. It was a cool movie. I ain't gonna knock on it, but it isn't canon. There is no Android 13. None of those movies are canon. Exactly. By our standards, by the Bo fan Jack. standards. No. No. Did not that, even no. the Broly movies. None of the Broly's None ones either. None of the either. Broly no. ones, but now he's canon because of circumstances. the movie update and circumstances. They but wrote that's it the thing. He's canon that. because of the popularity, and yep. we all know Super Saiyan 4 is popularity. Right. right, but like, I would argue like Janemba's Janemba's popular too. I fucked with him already. Yeah, and that movie was. That's why that he's one of the next heavy. ones. He 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 and Cooler are next in line. Yeah, yeah I forgot about Cooler. They're basically yeah. guaranteed. Cooler's guaranteed. I can tell you that right now. They're There's gar- no they're fucking way. Hundred percent guaranteed. Cooler. There's no way they're not gonna get him. But even his movie is not canon because of the time, like of where they were in that part of the story. Like if they said some shit about that movie in particular, or him as a character. Er, way earlier, like by the, by the Frieza saga type shit, then it would add up, line up, make sense. Listen, you got you ain't got to tell us. We know, we know. I'm oh, this, 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 this whole conversation was not meant to like reestablish like what is and what isn't. We know. I'm sure some of our listeners fucking know, or that y'all should, right? Okay, I put it that I put it right there. Okay, but when it comes down to the what 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 is to come potentially that's what i'm just trying to get everybody like not worried for i guess now i probably did by accident sorry but like this is the, these are the people that we're dealing with here okay like until something is officially done that says otherwise you can't rule out gt because here's the other thing that i wanted to just bring up about this and then we can like move on or keep no. talking about it or whatever is that the one scumbag thing they could do is that whenever they decide to finally get out of this 10 year gap that which they have already fucked up right they retconned themselves right is if they have another time skip and the time skip specifically takes place when after they beat omega shenron and we don't see anything because why because according to toei it already happened aka gt is fair and that would (laughs) oh my god that That would be be so so beyond fucked no that would just be like embarrassing that's a huge smack to the face it's a huge l huge it wouldn't be the first one lost the money (laughs) <laughs> lost money in dragon the air. ball l <laughs> in the air <laughs> yeah no like i it just it just occurred to me i'm like that would be the most scumbag thing they could ever do if they did if, if they didn't want to like because you know how companies can do that right they can literally just have things happen make things make products sometimes some of those products don't really work that out that well they just literally sweep it under the rug no, but, they never acknowledge but... it they never bring it up they never talk about it even when they're asked they give some That's bogus head ass right they give some bogus head ass answer and they keep it moving and they keep trying to talk about and push whatever's current and also i don't want to bring this up and get people confused in saying like something like super dragon ball heroes is now also canon because that was specifically made for the video game which we already know, video games are literally their own fucking thing as it is. They do not count. None of the fucking video games count. Not even Kakarot counts, okay? It has been factually and historically shown time and time again. Video games will always more than likely, like 99% of the time, whenever there's a story mode involved or whatever, there's always things that are altered, always things that are changed. And that's just the nature of it. And that's what happens. And you're not supposed to look at these fucking video game storylines, whether it's Xenoverse, whether it's Super Dragon Ball Heroes, whether it's any of the Budokais, the Tenkaichi, the Sagas, the fucking raging fucking D's nuts. Okay. None hey, of you know, the- but that Hatchak movie kind of slapped though. Yeah, but see, Hatchiak, that was what that, <laughs> that was a bonus that was yeah, included yeah, yeah. in the video game, but that was a that was something that happened in Japan, like normally. Yes. You know, but again It wasn't ever even dubbed. Nope. I don't think it was because I, I don't think I it never was found it. I, I don't think it was, to be honest. I'm surprised that, so. that one never came over, but whatever. So, but yeah, that's the, that's the, that's what, that's the one thing that we just have to kind of like let simmer in the back of our minds and be like, oh man, this, uh, let's hope that the best case scenario is they, they just have to retcon GT altogether. And then that, there that's, it is. 
that's the thing though like that they're they've gone all over the place with their stories between the games and I, I know we're not talking about the games here but i'm talking about you know like heroes and shit like that now yeah. that it has its own fucking anime but like they've gotten so out of control with the games and the story and then like the non-canon story and the movies and shit like their last and final saving grace is just to mcu this bitch we've said how many times have we fucking talked about that i know we have and it's just like that's that's the only thing i could think of like look all they have to do is make one statement like that and then it's a wrap everything can make sense in its own way and they can just make right. it work so i don't know i don't know what they're thinking i don't they've been making i mean from a money standpoint odd fucking moves. they know what they have to do if they fuck up and they do this dumbass bullshit by skipping and then like trying to make up for it Oh, imagine that's where the new super fuck. starts is after Omega Shenron. Everybody in that office getting fired. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's mine. <laughs> it's mine. <laughs> Go to the comments, bro. All right. <laughs> oh, that's that good shit. <laughs>